What up YouTube, this is a, another Ace Talks and we're coming at you with a weird one now So I get, I meet a lot of people on a day-to-day -day basis A lot of strange, weird people So the past couple of days has been very strange, very eventful and somewhat annoying You get some, some odd weirdos, I mean you get the fucking These people, where the fuck do they come from? They literally drive me absolutely batshit insane with the random shit that they talk about. So let's just let's, let's, let's dive straight into it. You know, why not? Why not? Because you know what? People need to know the amount of fucking complete shit turds that I have to deal with on a day-to-day -day basis and what the, the crap that spews out their mouth. So, let's give you a little thing. Yesterday, so this is, today is what? The, uh, today is the 14th so yesterday was the 13th so on the 13th yep um some guy walks into this some guy walks in so he comes up to me and he goes i'm looking for a dvd recorder and i ask him why do you want a dvd recorder and he says to me he's got a great business plan it's going to make me and him both a lot of money so i was like okay Let's hear it. Let's hear. Let's hear your Shark Tank, your million-dollar pitch. Let's just hear this idea. So I'm always interested to see. So we get some weirdos that always come up to you and try and give you some unique money-saving sort of crap. It's like, what are you going on about? So this guy goes, "Well, oh, he's going to buy a DVD recorder off me. And what we'll do, we'll do some sort of negotiation. We'll strike a deal. I've got loads of DVDs, but I buy the original DVDs from you. Okay." I buy a DVD recorder. I go to his, I go to Poundland. So if you're not aware what Poundland, is, Poundland is this this store that literally sells everything for like a pound each. So he buys blank DVDs. He wants to go ahead and buy blank DVDs from Poundland. And buy the originals off me. Make copies of the originals so he has more than one of that DVD, and he wants to sell them. So essentially, he wants to buy a DVD recorder and pirate movies and sell them. So I'm thinking to myself, what the hell? This ain't this ain't like fucking a decade a decade ago, man. Right? People used to like sell fake DVDs, you know, DVDs, you know, like new films that come out. That's all the rage, you know. So, but this guy, this guy has a a cracking idea. I mean, what the fuck? He wants to. Buy a DVD recorder <laughs> to just, just, just absorb this information. Just absorb how stupid this is. He wants to buy a DVD recorder. He wants to buy DVDs of me. Go to Poundland. The DVD is probably gonna, I'm, I'm, I'm assuming per DVD is going to cost him a pound. Okay. He's going to spend his time. He's going to burn. Uh, I'm not sure if the DVD you have to watch the entire movie, but he has to burn the entire DVD onto another blank disc so now he has two copies of the film one original one non original he's going to do that multiple times and he's going to sell the DVDs you just hypothetically if you buy the DVD of me for a pound how on earth does this guy what, what, what goes through this guy's mind seriously seriously what is going through this guy's mind what, what, I'm just and then I've got another guy there as well, and he's just standing around, just just listening to what the hell is going on. And he's just, his face goes like, just a balloon about to pop. He's just like... <laughs> this guy is just fucking nuts. And I go, um, you know what? I ain't got any DVD recorders, man. I don't want to be involved in your pirated DVD venture that's 10 years too late, okay? And what makes no sense, if you buy DVDs, DVDs are worth nothing, literally, because at the end of the day, they take up space. You can just watch everything online, you can stream everything. I mean, people are more used now. I mean, Netflix, they're more used to streaming using Netflix, Amazon Prime. There's those are sort of streaming services out there. I mean, how even BBC iPlayer and stuff like, or ITV Hub. There's, just, there's so many services out there, and who cares about these old films? But this guy, seriously. Anyway, that's uh, one of the many examples of it. just this. Crazy nonsense that I have to deal with on a day-to-day -day basis. Have you ever encountered any mad sort of 
theory like this, you know, you know, let me know because this is just insane. But anyway, this is been nice. As always, like, subscribe. I'll see you guys next. Peace out.